G'day, this is Chris from Down Under on the Gold Coast, Queensland, Australia. Right, we're into another bathroom this week and this is the third day. I'll just turn the camera around. Right, so we've done the floor. I'm just about to do the walls now. It's all a flush floor, no hob. There is my aluminium. The aluminium just sits below the tile. The glass will come to about where my finger is, and then you walk in through, turn the tap on, it's a mixer, and out comes your water for your share. Brilliant. See how you always turn the waist to a diamond? That takes your fall, like I explained the other day. So we'll zap these walls up. I'll set up a tripod and you'll be able to see what I'm doing in a minute. G'day, this is Chris from the Gold Coast, Queensland, Australia. This is, uh, I'll just turn this sucker around. This is the bathroom. So this is the um, fourth day. I did this tiling yesterday. yesterday. Around we go. Yeah, all six for three white. And I go into this toilet today. up to the ceiling, keeping the original floor, that's a new floor in there, but so I will have it all tiled today. Yeah, right, so back again. clips in Same principle, same. You're always watching your lines. Always watching your lines.
the big thing to wall tiling is if you start off bang on like dead level when you're dead level and straight you're always plumb you never have to check for plumbness if you are dead level And the way for easy tiling is you must always be exactly level and straight. Then you've got no worries at all and everything goes up like shell and peas. But if you're not straight and level you're stuffed. You've got trouble. The whole key to tiling is start off right. If you don't, you're in trouble. <laughs> 